Hi, I'm Kyle Cook with Bear Creek Photography NC. Melissa is again hard at work at her real job. I'm here to bring you your next image maker's assignment. Your assignment for July is silhouettes. This kind of ties into your last assignment, backlighting, in that making a silhouette, your subject is also backlit. The difference in a silhouette is that your subject goes dark, completely dark. You will be metering for your background. Sunrises and sunsets are great backgrounds for silhouettes. Grab a friend and go practice turning them into silhouettes. We talked about matrix and evaluative metering in our last assignment. Again, you will not be using matrix or evaluative meeting, metering, I can't say that word for the life of me, in this assignment because you do not want any light on your subject, just behind it. You don't want to see your subject's features. While people make great subjects for silhouettes, trees or other inanimate objects can also make interesting silhouettes. The key word there is interesting. Don't just use anything that's handy for your subject. That subject, subject should have or be able to make an interesting shape to feature as your silhouette. Don't be afraid to underexpose your sunrise or sunset a bit. It will make a more colorful background for your subject. Realism isn't entirely required or critical here. If you want to saturate your sunset or sunrise a little bit, that's fine. After all, often the color is what makes a striking silhouette. Also, try using your white balance creatively here. Change it to a fluorescent or a 10,000 K for a sunrise sunset. That can help add color or enhance the existing colors. You can do this in the computer later if you're shooting raw photos. Post-processing may be used tastefully. Of course, taste is subjective. This assignment is due by midnight on August 5th. We like to give you the entire weekend before the due date to work on your assignment just in case you're a procrastinator. We want to give you no reason to not participate. Remember, up your game and get creative. Don't settle for mediocrity. Aim high. Your label for this assignment is silhouette number one and silhouette number two. Bonus points if you spell it correctly. Just kidding. Well, kinda. So grab a friend, get out, and make some fun silhouettes. Be creative and daring. Until next time, see ya.